Hi, my name is Jorge Rivera. I'm one of the team leads here at the Kansas City Zoo. I've been working here for a little bit over two years and I work in the African Savanna team. I work with a lot of different animals that you see in documentaries. Lions, antelope, zebra, giraffes, rhinos, all the little critters that live in northern Africa, sand cats, bat-eared foxes, fennec foxes, ostriches, a whole bunch of stuff. So I first learned about wild animals and stuff like everybody does through like documentaries and stuff. But visiting my local zoo, I'm from Puerto Rico. There's only one zoo in the country. So that was my only opportunity to see wild animals. And it was at our local zoo in the island, which was a really cool learning experience. And from then on, I knew I wanted to work with wild animals in some capacity. The most challenging part about working with wild animals is that it's always something new every day and you never know when your day is going to get more difficult or easier because of the animals you work with. You know, nature does not cooperate and we, I work with some very large animals that sometimes don't want to move, sometimes don't want to do what you want them to do, but you work around them and sometimes your days might go a little bit longer because of it, sometimes your days might get a little bit more work intensive, hard on the body, but it's rewarding still at the end of the day. The most common misconception about working with animals is that a lot of people think that we just play with animals, but that's not the case. We do a whole lot of things here at the zoo that go from cleaning uh, for them, feeding them, taking care of them medically, you know, doing behavioral observations. And it's a lot of hard work and it, it's sometimes it's longer than eight hours, it's longer than 40 hours a week. It's long, long nights for animals that are sick. It's early mornings for animals that need to get fed on a different schedule than our normal nine to five. And again, very hard on the body, very labor intensive. It's a lot of heavy lifting, you know, working with big animals, even the little ones, you have to chop diets up that are like really, really fine. So you, we have chef skills, we have maintenance skills, we have plumber skills, we have all these skills that are not just, oh, look at me, look what I can do with animals. And it's, it's, it's we wear many hats throughout the day. And a lot of people think that it's just being a zookeeper is just getting to play with animals. And that's just not the case. Uh, my favorite part about working with animals is just the relationship that you build with not only the animals but the people that you work with. You know, we, we share in our successes and we sorrow in, our, in our, our lows. You know, when an animal is sick, when an animal unfortunately passes away, we all share that together. But when we, something good happens, when there's an animal birth or when there's a new training breakthrough, um, we get to celebrate with the people that we work with and we also get to celebrate with the animals. You know, they're, they're part of our family, they're part of our team. They don't work for us, we don't work for them, we work with one another. So forming those relationships with the animals and the people that you work with is, is one of the most rewarding parts about the job for sure.